Hey, I'm Brian, leader of the KTSY family, general manager here, and I'm so excited about what we're launching uh, and have launched with India Partners. This is an incredible project that um, I don't know that's ever been done before quite like this. And I got David Harms here with India Partners so we can talk about it a little bit. We've had this desire, you know, we've been involved internationally in Rwanda, Honduras, various places throughout the years, but we really felt a need to just take a project and invest deep in it, not just a fundraiser once a year, because people are just busy and whatever, but to actually take a project that we could see massive transformation happen over the course of several years and let it become part of our mission as a radio station. Mm -hmm. Our mission is simple. We're here to inspire people, to connect people, to help them experience God and then impact other people's lives. And Jesus was really clear, Jerusalem, Judea, Samaria, the ends of the earth. And we do a lot here locally with the Boise Rescue Mission, with pregnancy care centers, with other places. And this is our international outreach and we're, we're, we've launched it this summer into this mm -hmm. fall. I'm excited about this. Take us into this village that we're going into. What does this look like? What's gonna happen? Well, we are coming alongside a village, and the beauty of this is that it's not a Band-Aid, it's not a quick fix, because mm -hmm. usually transformation isn't that fast. Right. Right, and so with this partnership, we are gonna kind of pick a spot on the map, you and I are gonna be going there, in uh, somewhere, in, <laughs> so, kind of over on this side of the country, um, and we're uh, identifying the village that we will partner with. Now, I've been to some of these villages in that region. I will tell you this much, it is extreme poverty. Mm -hmm. uh, it just is. The, the water source I watched as a whole group of women went to down this path and right in the middle of the path they stopped, dug a hole and they were digging water out of the thing. It was just ri Ew. ridiculously bad. And there's no wonder that the kids are sick, they're dying and just it's just pretty terrible actually. And so what we're going to start to do with Team Transformation is kind of enter in with the current need but simultaneously this is where I get really excited. Mm -hmm. We're gonna address the spiritual needs as well because all parts of this project are spearheaded on the ground by a pastor mm -hmm. trained to not only do development work like water wells and agriculture and all the rest, but they are a minister of the gospel. They mm -hmm. are a pastor. And what's gonna happen is as over time, we bring in the water wells, that gets dug, as the economics of the place start to grow, the pastor is rooted right into it and will eventually go live in that village. That's so cool. Right? And at the invitation of that village, be invited to plant and literally build a church building in that village. It's happened. This has kind of been done a few places. We call them the beta villages, mm -hmm. right? We're just trying it and it's worked so well. We're ready to just kind of expand this. So we see the gospel being presented in a very practical way over time with relationship at the front and center with that pastor being just a critical piece of it. And you've never seen a time where an organization like a radio station family or one particular organization just says, we're gonna adopt this village, support this pastor, help build the church, help build the well, and see economic, um, health, educational like and spiritual transformation happen in this village. Yeah, we've never we've never seen this happen before. This is so cool. There have been churches that have tried to attempt on this, but mm -hmm. uh, either they lose enthusiasm or the money just wasn't there to to start, but right. but this is new. Mm -hmm. And we're pretty excited to see this work because oh, and as by the way, as it happens to those who want to join Team Transformation, we send out, we'll send out updates. Our mm -hmm. pastor goes out with a camera. Hey, this is the village chief, you know. Mm -hmm. Here's the kids, this is the current water source. The water goes in, pictures of it going in. It's just gonna be a blast to watch this village change. This is part of what we're gonna be doing over the next couple of years here with KTSY, and you'll be seeing these updates consistently on mm -hmm. social media, on the air, uh, all kinds of different ways that will be keeping you in the loop on how this village is transformed. This week we're launching launching the project, and of course the well is the first point. There, This is a community that's stuck in the caste system so deeply mm -hmm. that um, they can't go to a neighboring well, uh, a neighborhood village, because if they're in a different caste system, they can be beaten and even killed for taking water there. So they're going, getting this horrible water in horrible locations. Mm -hmm. Women are walking back and forth, sometimes miles at a time, yeah. to bring back water uh, that is dirty and parasite ridden from the beginning. So the well is the first entry point into this community mm -hmm. to start this relational process, to see it to see it transformed in the name of Jesus and this village come to Christ. See, that's the thing. This is how desperate they are. It's illegal 
to convert to Christianity. Yet, they are because the physical needs are being taken care of and they're like, oh, your God does this, tell me about your God. So even though it's illegal to convert, it's happening because of this work. It's what Jesus did. I mean, he met people's needs. He healed them to build the relationship, to build the trust. And then he said, come follow me. He built their trust and said, come follow me. And that's what we're doing. So it starts out this week. And if you haven't had a chance yet, I'm going to invite you to go to KTSY.org because you can start on team transformation right now. Right now. What is, how much is it? How does it, how does it start? Uh, $29 a month is how it begins. Mm -hmm. uh, you just sign up. And then we'll start giving you everything from here's where we're at. And then when you and I go, which is going to be in January, we'll mm -hmm. do updates on the air and oh, yeah. video updates as, all, as well, just for everyone to see the village that we're going to choose for you. So the process is starting right now. The pastor is in, in training with his team. Um, we're getting everything prepped and ready. And uh, so we've got to get the money for the well. That starts with that $29 a month right now. And then we're starting this process of transformation, which again includes education, uh, church, um, everything. It's going to completely, utterly transform this village by people on the ground who are native to, to India. This isn't just Westerners coming in. This is happening by the people um, of India, and we're just partnering to help make it happen. So head over to, to, uh, to ktsy.org, $29 a month. Let's get this thing started. Let's do this. Let's do it big. I'm so excited. We've never done anything like this before, and I'm excited to see what God is going to do through you. So thank you.